going on guys getting ready to take this gen 8 for a rip since i put my canyon trail tires on there it's still my buddy's truck we've been debating on trading i think i'm gonna go ahead and trade him you know i don't know i need the truck it, it needs some work the shocks are shot on it i need some more i don't know if the seals are bad but this thing pulls a trailer like it ain't nothing so I'll, i need it back to pull my trailer to be honest so probably work a deal with him on that again get it back plus my grandson loves the truck so we got to get it back because I, I give this one back to my grandson he likes the old green one johnny even likes the old green one so i think we need to go green again but it does need some work i'm gonna go ahead and take her for a rip i don't have no way to mount my phone on a controller so i'm gonna use my tripod and just do a few little runs with it have some fun so we'll go from there let's see what happens what do they call that when you got a headlight out bediddle <laughs> or something like that Well, we're not going for dirt today either. I do like my sticker layout on it. Those wheels make a difference. Gear train, a drive train, whatever you want to call that, it don't sound the greatest on them, I ain't gonna lie. All the metal gears and stuff, I'm probably going to have to take all of the, I think everything in it's been wet. And I know I had not done the maintenance on it in a while, so. I got a feeling I really need to go through this entire truck if I trade them. Before something starts breaking on it. There's definitely something in his drivetrain that's not happy right now. I don't know. Maybe, maybe not. Oh, that was a rough run, but he saved it. He almost went off the bridge on that. I can carry this camera like this. Uh oh, that ain't gonna be good. <laughs> we tried. <laughs> All right we keep launching it like that i'm gonna have to trade them <laughs> start breaking shit that's why i'm allowed to play with other people's toys so they know i'll fix it when it breaks i'll put money into other people's stuff before i will my own it seems like Gears are just way dry. I'm gonna definitely have to lube it all up. I don't remember if I got the 35 turn or a 20 turn in here right now, but it's definitely better than what the stock motor was. I guarantee that. This thing really does all right with the trail canyons though, or canyon trails, whatever you call them. 
the only truck I got that don't bottom out real bad right there. Okay, now here's where we took bricks out. My grandson put some back. But down here at the bottom, I have not put nothing back where it needs to be. So my other, ain't no other truck been up this yet. Let's see what happens. This right here is a, it's a big drop right there. Yeah, I didn't think so. You can do that. That's not a bad looking ride right there. It's definitely fun to drive and everything. I mean, but they all are, I guess. I love every truck I get, that I play with. That's always a problem I have with, damn, I might be able to go this way and get up there. One thing about the top of this truck being the way it is, it'll roll right back to his wheels like a damn beetle. <laughs> Watch this. Roll over and back to the wheels. <laughs> uh, that's a good recovery vehicle, I suppose. That mud's making it a challenge right here. There we go. Now to get back up on this again. There we go. Let me back up. It ain't pretty, but it's going. That's what matters. Muddy tires or not, it's gonna go clean them off though. I'm not trying to get the whole truck all soaked. I just cleaned it a little bit. Oh, we got some lights out. See them shocks are crooked and healthy. The whole thing needs it. She definitely got some suspension issues and some gear issues, but I like working on them anyway, so that really doesn't bother me none. We can always upgrade it. I got a few different type of shocks anyway. So, all right, guys. Peace. I hope you guys enjoyed. I hope you enjoy the rest of your year. Till the next one. Later.